Hi, I'm Carl Hamilton with CecilDaily.com. I'm reporting from the Cecil County Circuit Courthouse in Elkton. A Northeast area man who pointed a replica handgun at two Maryland State Police troopers, prompting one of those troopers to open fire and wound that man in his legs, is facing up to 10 years in prison after accepting a plea deal here today. 35-year-old Christopher Blaine Thomas pled guilty to second-degree assault. His sentencing is set for December 5th. At that time, as part of the deal, prosecutors will drop remaining charges against Thomas, including attempted second-degree murder and first-degree assault. The incident happened in the morning hours of March 13th in the unit block of Pinecone Drive in the Montgomery Oaks development, north of Northeast. Troopers responded to that address after Thomas caused a disturbance and then fled. Thomas lived in the basement of that residence and his landlords lived on the first floor. When Thomas returned about three hours later, the landlords called police. When troopers arrived, Thomas was in the backyard holding the replica handgun to his head. Believing that the weapon was real, Troopers ordered him several times to drop the weapon, and Thomas ignored them. Then Thomas pointed the gun at the troopers, and one of the troopers opened fire. In court today, prosecutors said that Thomas later told paramedics that he wanted the troopers to shoot and kill him because he wanted to commit suicide. For more on this story, stay tuned to CecilDaily.com or read the Wednesday edition of The Wig.